from here, moving right into three-part breathing. On your next inhale, and you can just bring one hand to low belly and one to heart center if that's helpful to you. On your next inhale, begin to fill your belly. Allow your rib cage to expand and notice the chest rise. Exhaling, chest lowers, ribs hug, and gently draw your navel towards your spine. We're going to keep going here, gently filling up belly, rib cage, chest, exhaling chest, ribs, drawing the navel in. Keep going. Beginning to slow the breath down, allowing that exhale to be slightly longer than your inhale. From here, releasing the hands into the lap. You can keep the eyes closed here for just a moment and go ahead and bring the hands together. We're gonna rub the hands together vigorously, creating a little heat between the hands. And cupping the eyes, dropping the head into the hands for just a moment, feeling that warmth around the eye socket. And just gently beginning to massage the forehead. And down the bridge of the nose, around the eye sockets, and the temple. Massaging the face, and the jawline, in front of and behind the ears maybe even into the neck a bit. Releasing the hands from here. Draw your shoulders back and down. Sit up nice and tall. Slowly open the eyes. I'm gonna turn my chair so you can get a better angle at me. That sounds gonna be the window here. So from here, we're still at the edge of the chair. You're going to sit up nice and tall, inhale, exhale, drop your chin to chest. So shoulders are nice and relaxed away from the ears. Your head is nice and heavy. Breathe. 
From here, we're gonna inhale ear to shoulder. So you're just rolling ear to shoulder. Right ear to right shoulder. Draw the left shoulder back and down. So you're creating some extra space here in the neck, between the neck and the shoulder. And breathe into that area, opening up. Breathe. Exhale back to center, inhale toward the other side. So left ear is over left shoulder. Draw the right shoulder back and down this time, creating some space in the right side of the neck. Breathing here. Exhale back to center, head is heavy. Inhale the head back up. Draw the shoulders back and down. From here, we're going to bring the forearms together and interlace the fingers. And just begin with a few wrist circles here, just moving in one direction and try to make full circles all the way around. And see if you can keep your forearms together here. Nice, gentle breath. Yoga is all about the breath. All of the postures in yoga are secondary to your breath. Keep going here. Any cracking or popping that you hear is perfectly normal. Just working through that. And moving in the opposite direction. When you're ready. Pressing through the palms, round the shoulder blades, drop your chin to chest for just a moment. Release the hands and maybe grab behind you. Inhale, lift up through the heart. Maybe look up if it feels good to the neck and shoulders. Otherwise, just keep the gaze in front of you. Keep the heart nice and open. Take a few breaths here. And exhale, come back to center, release. Maybe shake out the hands just a bit here. From here, we're going to bring hands to shoulders. So I'm gonna turn this way. This is what it looks like. You're bringing hands to shoulders here. And we're just going to start to turn side to side. So we're gonna inhale at center, exhale, turning at that middle thoracic spine, maybe keeping the gaze forward or over the, over the opposite shoulder here. Inhale, center, exhale, turn. And just keep going here at your own pace. Inhale back to center, release the hands, shake out the hands for just a moment. You can feel good. And we're gonna come back to hands to shoulders and we're just gonna do a few back strokes here. So we're making circles, Let's continue to breathe. Little ducky back strokes. <laughs> warming up the shoulders and freestyle, little ducky freestyle. So we're moving forward here, breathing.
and release the hands, shake out the hands. <clears throat> A few shoulder circles here, shoulder shrugs. Come, come right here to center. Sit up nice and tall, keep that chin tucked. We're gonna inhale, draw the shoulders up nice and close to the ears. Inhale, stretch them up nice and close. Exhale, release. Inhale, shoulders come close to the ears. Release. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. All right. A few shoulder rolls here. Forward and back. From here, interlace the fingers. And just Bring the elbow so that they're in line with the shoulders here and just start to pull on the fingers. Like you're thinking of like pulling them apart. It seems, can feel really good to the joints and the fingers, especially if you have um, arthritis. And take your time, really breathe through this. Sometimes it may not feel so good in the beginning, but something to work towards. Continue to breathe. Focus on your breath. Release, shake the hands just a bit. All right. So from here, we're going to keep going down the body here. We're just going to go ahead and bring um, hands to the right hip and just start to make circles around that hip joint. Keep breathing. And then some back and forth movements along the thigh. And even maybe some padding here. Just waking things up. Try to make some circles around the knee joint. So on that right leg here, take your time. You can go as quickly or as slowly as you like. Inhale, come back up to center. Maybe a few more times up and down that leg, the thigh here. Come on back to center. And let's do the other side. So again, circling this hip joint on the left side. Moving back and forth, up and down that thigh, the outside of the leg here. And then inhale back to center. So from here, you're gonna sit up nice and tall. Inhale, exhale, draw the navel in. We're gonna go ahead and cross the right ankle over the left thigh. So you don't wanna place any weight on your knee, just bringing that 
right ankle over the left thigh here. Maybe a few times, give him a little rub and um, massage around that right knee joint for just a moment. If this hurts your knee, please don't do this. <clears throat> We're gonna start working right into foot. So, um, we're just gonna start by just stroking up and down the sole of the foot, just making some movements from heel to the ball of the foot and then back to the heel. And then maybe opening the toes, spreading the toes really nice and wide here. This can feel pretty good. And just allowing some energy to flow where there might be tightness. Just continuing to massage that foot. Spreading the toes, even thinking about um, massaging in between the, the bones of the foot. All right, so from here, you wanna make sure there's space and that maybe you can um, interlace your fingers in between the toes here. If that feels good to you, if it's a little too much, just grab the foot and we're just gonna make some circles with the ankle. So with the fingers between the toes, we're looking to open up energy in the foot and just allow some energy to flow through the body. And we're just, again, making some small circles here. Continue to breathe. Some nice, gentle self-care this morning before we move into just a small um, sun salutation practice. And then moving in the opposite direction. Continue to be gentle with yourself. And from here, releasing, maybe rub the ankle for just a moment. Release that foot. Maybe a few side to side movements with the knees for just a moment can feel good. And we'll do the other side. So crossing left ankle over the right thigh this time. Again, try not to put any pressure on the knee. And we're gonna start again just by massaging the sole of the foot. So heel to the ball of the foot and then back to the heel. Just up and down the sole of the foot a few times. Breathe. And again, massaging the foot in between the bones and the top of the foot, spreading the toes really nice and wide. Do what feels good to you. Maybe spending some extra time on um, places that might feel tight or uncomfortable. Maybe even some circular motions around the heel can feel good. And again, we'll work right into interlacing fingers between the toes if that's available to you. 
and making some circles at the ankle. Just moving in one direction, continuing to breathe. Moving in the opposite direction. Release the fingers here and just maybe give a little massage around the ankle. And release. Do um, movements with the knees here, a little side to side movement. And go ahead and come back to seated. And we're going to start with a short sun salutation. So I'd like for you to sit up nice and tall, lift up through the crown of the head, bring the hands to the knees here. Sit up nice and tall. Um, ankles are just below the knees. Spread your toes really nice and wide for that nice energy flow. Inhale. Exhale, draw the navel in. A few cat-cow movements here in the chair. We're going to inhale, lift up through the heart. Maybe look up if it feels good to you. Or just keep the gaze forward. Whatever feels good to the um, neck and head. Exhale, drop your chin to chest. Round your spine. Navel, to spine. Inhale, back to center. Inhale. Exhale, draw the navel in. Again, inhaling, lifting up through the heart. Slight back bend here. Look up if it feels good to the neck and head. Exhale, chin to chest, round the spine, belly in. Inhale, back to center. One more time. Inhale. Exhale, draw the navel in. Inhale, lift up through the heart. Maybe look up. Exhale, chin to chest, round the spine. Inhale, back to center. Your shoulder rolls here. Moving right into our sun salutation. Inhale, arms overhead. Ears and arms are in line with each other. Exhale, hinge at your hip creases, fold forward. So you're looking to bring your belly to your thighs and then allow the hands to come down and maybe touch the floor. If they don't, that's okay. You can bring them to the shins. So ex exhale in here, bringing hands to knees. So we're gonna roll back up on the inhale, try to come back up one vertebra at a time. Head will come up last. Inhale, exhale, draw the right knee in, flex the foot. Inhale, release. Exhale, draw the left knee in. Exhale, release. Again, inhaling, arms overhead. Exhaling, hinging at the hip creases, fold forward. Hands to knees, roll yourself back up, one vertebrae at a time on your inhale, head will come up last. 
Exhale, draw the right knee in, flex the foot. Inhale, release. Exhale, draw the left knee in. Exhale, release. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, fold. Hands to knees. Inhale, roll yourself back up. Exhale, draw the right knee in. Inhale, release. Exhale, draw the left knee in. Exhale, release. One more time. Inhale, arms overhead. Maybe look up this time if it feels good. You can create a slight back bend here. Exhale, fold. Hands to knees. Inhale, roll yourself back up one vertebrae at a time. Exhale, right knee in. Inhale, release. Exhale, left knee in. Inhale, release. Come back to seated. Sit up nice and tall. A few shoulder rolls here. This time we're going to inhale, open the arms nice and wide. Exhale, give yourself a hug. Nice and tight here. And then just a few rocks side to side. Inhale, open. Exhale, opposite arm on top this time. Hug yourself. Be gentle with yourself. One more time each side. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale, open. Exhale, opposite arm on top. And release. Shake the hands for just a moment. This time we're going to move right into um, eagle posture. So I'm going to turn to face you so you can get a better look. We're just going to cross the right leg over the left. So you can stay right here if you'd like. And we're just um, grounding down through the left foot. So spread the toes really nice and wide. If you can and you'd like to bring the right foot behind the left leg so that you're getting this nice twist here. If that feels good to you and is available to you, sometimes it feels good to give a little, you know, a little massage down the outside of that thigh. If this hurts the knees, Please don't take it this far. Just crossing is fine. Otherwise, just breathe. We're just doing the legs first. Maybe a little massage around the knee. And release. Sit up nice and tall. Inhale, exhale. And we're going to cross the left leg over right this time. Again, you can stay here or you can bring that left foot behind the right leg. And again, a little massage around the knee. Make sure you're sitting up nice and tall. Keep some nice space going on here. And a little massage up and down the outside of the thigh. And even just cross ankles. So whatever feels good. All right, release, and we're gonna do only arms this time. So inhale, right arm comes up nice and high. We're gonna bring the left arm under the right and maybe bring the hands together. 
So you're going to inhale, lift up to the elbows, and you're getting a nice stretch behind the shoulder blades, maybe a few rocks side to side. Be gentle. And release. A few shoulder rolls here. We're going to do the opposite side. Inhale, left arm comes up, right arms under. And again, bringing hands together if that's available to you. Lift up the elbows so the elbows and the shoulders are in line with each other. You rock side to side. And release. Shoulder rolls. Let's do both together this time. We're going to cross right leg over left. You can cross at ankles or you can come here with um, knees crossed or you can even bring that right foot behind the left leg if that feels good to you. We're going to inhale left arm up, right arm comes under, bringing hands together. Breathing here. Lift up through the elbows. Maybe if it's available to you and it feels good, maybe hinge up the hip creases, fold forward. Inhale, come back up to seated. Exhale, release. Take a breath here for just a moment. And we'll do the opposite side. So again, um, you can cross at the ankles, you can cross at the knees, or you can even bring that left foot behind the right leg, whatever feels good. You're gonna inhale the right arm up, the left arm comes under, bring the hands together if that's available to you. Take a few breaths here for just a moment, maybe a few side to side rocks. And again, if it's available to you, take a nice deep breath here. Exhale, hinge at the hip creases. Fold forward. Inhale back to seated. Exhale, release. A few shoulder rolls. All right. So we're going to come to standing from here. And we're going to use the back of the chair. So. Let's um, go ahead and come up to standing. I'm going to readjust my chair here, move it forward just a little bit. <clears throat> and we're going to use the back of the chair in our next poses. Let me see, make sure everyone can see me here. So keep the hands in the back of the chair. We're going to stand up nice and tall, and you're going to make sure that your feet are hip distance apart. So you want your your feet to be hip distance, that's your hip bones, down through knees and ankles, all right? If you put a slight bend in your knees, your tailbone will drop and that will create a nice neutral spine alignment. Maybe release the hands here for just a moment. Palms are facing forward. And just take a couple of breaths here, okay? Just take a few breaths here. From here, we're going to slowly start to walk the feet back. We're going to come into a forward fold of the chair. And you're going to walk the feet back as far as you can come into a nice forward fold here. So we're looking to bring ears in line with the arms. If that doesn't happen, it's okay. Put a slight bend in your knee or even a deep bend in the knees if you have really tight hamstrings or glutes. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, 
sink the head between the arms here. Again, ears are in line with your arms. You're gazing down towards the mat. The toes are nice and spread wide apart here. Inhale, exhale, draw your navel in. One more breath here. Inhale, look between the hands and start to walk your way back towards your chair. Coming back to standing, give a few shoulder rolls here. And one more time. Actually, we're gonna do this two more times, three times a charm. Inhale, exhale, spread those toes really nice and wide. We're looking for a nice equal standing posture here. Hip bones down through knees and ankles. Release the chair if you can, if that's available to you. And then again, bring hands back to your chair. We're gonna to start to walk it back one more time. And only come to where is comfortable for you. If you cannot bring the ears in line with the arms, again, that's okay. Inhale before we come into this um, deep fold, look forward. Exhale, start to gaze towards your mat. Press the hips back. So we're really opening the side body. How about this time? Your knees are nice and um, there's some deep, not necessarily a deep bend, but whatever feels good to you, then maybe just sort of wag your tail feathers back and forth. So you're sort of opening up the side body, getting a nice stretch here. Feels so good. Breathing. Inhale, look between the hands and slowly start to make your way back up to the chair. Inhale, exhale, draw the navel in. And we'll one more time get to step it back. Nine. Feet are spread apart here. Toes are nice and wide. Gazing towards the mat. Every exhale, drawing that navel toward the spine. Inhale, look up between the hands and go ahead and cross right hand over left. So we're looking, looking up between the hands for just a moment. Right hand is on top of the left hand, inhale, Exhale, sink it back. Deep stretch for the side body here. One more breath. Inhale. We're gonna start to look between the hands once more. Crossing left hand over right this time. Exhale, sink the hips back. Deeply into the side body and on the left side this time, breathing. <coughs> One more breath here. Inhale, look up between the hands. Hands are spread apart. And just start to walk back towards, the, towards your chair, towards the back of your chair. And coming back to standing here. This time we're gonna move into a crescent pose. So in crescent pose, you're just going to step the right foot back. 
your heel is not going to make it all the way to your mat. You're gonna put a slight bend in that back knee and you want your feet to be more on a train track and not on a tightrope. So we're slightly bending that back knee and we're deeply bending into the left knee. So you want your knee and your ankle to be directly on top of each other. You can stay here with your arms in your chair. You're lifting up to the heart, looking forward. If it feels good to you and you feel nice and stable, you can start to inhale the arms overhead. Breathe. Hips are nice and square. Shoulders are relaxed away from the ears. One more breath. Release the hands back to your chair. Step the right foot up to meet the left. Take a break here for just a moment. If you bend the knees in and out, do whatever feels good to you. And we're gonna do the opposite side. So when you're ready, keep your hands in the back of your chair for just a moment. We're gonna step the left foot back this time. So you want a nice, wide stance here, as wide as it feels good to you. And again, feet are on a train track and not together in a tight rope. You're gonna put a bend in that back knee. So your heel's not gonna, hopefully you can see me here, but your heel's not gonna come all the way to the floor. Bending deeply into that right knee, inhale and lifting up the arms here, if that feels good to you. Keeping hands on the back of your chair if that feels better. Bring hands back to the back of your chair. Step up, left foot to meet the right. And give me just a moment. So we're here. Nice, strong legs here and the in poses like this. Um, I'm running over with my time here. So why don't we come back to seated for just a moment and we'll end our practice um, just with a little bit of seated breathing one more time. So you can come back to your chair. <clears throat> Feet are hip distance. Sit up nice and tall. And we'll take a few breaths here. And just making your way back into a nice normal breathing pattern from here. Bringing hands together at heart center. Thank you all so very much for joining me this morning. And can enjoy the rest of your day. Peace and blessings to everyone. Stay well. Namaste.